Yo, 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 it's your boy DJ Blaze, and I'm back once again with the True Hip Hop Podcast. Before we get started, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel, like, comment, and share. It helps your boy out tremendously on the algorithm. I appreciate all the love y'all been giving us, but cats ain't been subscribing, so hit that bell. And make sure it's all notifications, you heard me? Aight, man, we just finna just dive into these YouTube streets, man. Yesterday on DX Magazine, Krishan Rock has accused WAC 100 of sending goons to rob Blueface home while he's behind bars. The rapper and reality star made a wild claim on a live stream where she detailed the alleged incident at her ex-boyfriend's house where Rock and her infant child are currently living. Addressing Wack, who manages Blueface, she said, you must be the mother that sent them ninjas here to rob us. Them ninjas talking about it didn't happen. Who the would play with some shit like that, bro? We got kids, yo. You fucking weird as fuck. You should have asked if we was good. Do you need me to send some protection over there? Or are you trying to act like that's why nobody like y'all? Since Blue got locked up, everybody got mad about who's in the house, she continued. Y'all don't like this ninja phone. Y'all don't like my dumb ass. So y'all sending weird people to the house. Okay, I got it. And it's funny because I don't usually care when he's trolling and shit. But bitch... That's real life. Like fucking real. Krishan went on to tell Wack, stop lying over this incident. (laughs) So the other day, Krishan Rock got on her live and um, she said, Blueface, dad went to his car and some four dudes had guns and hoodies on, flattened his tire. He ran and punched in the cold to the house and got away. And they didn't get nothing. You hear what I'm saying? So Wack, he was like, yo, I got Blueface phone. And I got the security footage on his phone. And I didn't see none of this shit happen. You know, they said her dad be making up stories about getting robbed because he broke. And he just be trying to get money and shit. Um... Blueface mom, which is Blueface dad, you know, whatever, said uh, that he pulled this stunt back in September and told the same story just to get a couple dollars for gas and shit. You hear what I'm saying? But no one has posted the video. Krishan Rock hasn't posted the security video and WAC 100 hasn't posted the video. So... Who do we believe? You know what I'm saying? Is she doing this for clout since she ain't popping because Blueface ain't around? She can't call him because he in the hole and shit like that. And is she trying to get clout to get attention to get her views back up and shit? You hear what I'm saying? And she's also got this warrant and shit in Oklahoma for uh, beating up Tamar Braxton's stylist or whatever. You know they got a warrant for her. She said she's trying to get out of that shit. She's trying to pay the money. But they want you, baby girl. They want to lock your ass up. Can't be running around here punching people in the face, man. And fighting just anybody, man. Need that shit for the show, the baddie show or whatever. You know? She jumped her own sister and fighting all the fucking time, man. This shit is crazy, B. But, yeah, man. I think it might be for clout, man. Both of them are clout chasers, Wack 100 and um, Christian Wright. But what was the point of Wack 100 sending people to her crib to flatten a blue faced dad's tires and try to rob him knowing he ain't got no bread? What would be the point of that, man? So I'm looking at it like it's kind of like clout and shit, man. But she trying to say she want to get her life together. She don't want to fight no more. She don't want to go to jail. She want to clean up her act. She don't want to be with Blueface when he get out. She don't want to be in a toxic relationship anymore. But I think it's all a cap, man. 
I just think she needs attention at this point to try to get her numbers back up because when she got that tattoo on her face, you know, she lost like 500, no, 400,000 followers. <laughs> like, she been losing fans, man. All them people that was rocking with her when she was playing the symphony card, old Blueface beat me up and all this. She the one got him locked up because she said he punched her in her face and gave her raccoon eyes. That's why he locked up now, man, for violating probation. This must be the most toxic relationship I have ever saw, man. It's worse than Ike and Tina, Stevie J and Jocelyn. And it's just worse than everybody, man. This shit is ill, B. But I don't know, man. Comment below, man. Do y'all really think WAC 100 sent goons to their crib to rob them? What for? What would be the reason? And... Where's the video footage? Somebody posted. Something happened. His dad probably lying, man. Because he didn't get punched with the gat or nothing. <laughs> nothing you got away from four dudes. You know, and they flatten your tires. Hey, like, wow. Why would they do that? I don't know. Why wouldn't they just break into the crib? You know, instead of trying to run, rob your broke ass, man. They said he had a hoopty. Anybody with a hoopty, man, they ain't got no bread. So, I don't believe this. I don't believe he was robbed, man, or got attempted robbery on him. I don't believe that at all. I think it's all for cop, man. But comment below. Let me know what y'all think, man. Subscribe to the channel, man. I'm out of here. One love. Peace.